Samsung A20 charging IC bypass. Okay, uh, this is the phone. Uh, it was given to me today. It doesn't charge, and and I found out that um, an IC was a charging IC is missing. So I verified from the customer. He told me he plugged the phone with an unusual charger. He burnt the the charger and the phone got burnt. So he gave it to an a by nearby um, technician to fix the phone. Uh, which uh, I think eventually removed its IC, but now the phone is not even charging. So, uh, so that's the IC I have zoomed over here. So, that's the yeah, bypass I've been with the red arrow you saw. So in case, guys, please, I'm being too fast for you. You can just go back to the red arrow jumper um, uh, diagram, which I just showed now, and from there, you could locate the bypass I did. And then you could do your. Uh, I want to this opportunity, guys, to thank you guys for your comment, for your shares, for you know, for everything, you guys. Uh, I think for you guys have been you know um, helpful to me, encouraging me. And those comments, those shares, they, they encourage me to do more videos. I'm really grateful, guys. So um, so that's the jumper I did. You remember, guys? Uh, you need a very tiny wire. You need your jumper wire and a sharp picker, and make sure your shoulder only sharp. Because the, um, the the space from each uh, from each contact on from the board on this jumper is a very tiny space, so you need a very sharp solder iron to do this kind of work. Sharp solder iron and a, a very short uh, jumper wire to do this work, and you need to be careful uh, not to breach the other um, legs. So the work is done now, and so I'm showing you the geometric diagram. So this is the geometric diagram of what I just did now. And let's tell the phone is okay. The phone is working. So this is to like, uh, comments, and wait for more videos. Thanks, guys.